Gorillas. Hi there, animal lovers. Today, we are going to learn more about gorillas. Want to read along with us? Just head over to learnbright.org and download this lesson. What is a gorilla? Gorillas are large, strong animals that live in Central Africa's dense forests. They have dark fur that helps them blend in with their surroundings. You can often see them with a patch of silver hair on their backs as they age. Gorillas are known for their impressive strength and big muscular bodies. Their arms are longer than their legs, which helps them swing from tree branches. These animals are very social, just like us. They live in groups called troops or families. A troop usually has a large, strong male gorilla called a silverback because of his silver fur patch. The silverback is the leader and protector of the troop. Alongside him, there are female gorillas and their babies. Silverbacks can weigh as much as 400 pounds, 180 kilograms or more, which is twice as heavy as female gorillas. The size and strength of the silverback helps him maintain order within the troop and protect it from potential threats. Gorillas are wonderful parents. They treat their young ones with a lot of care and love. Baby gorillas are called infants, and their moms are very protective of them. Moms carry their infants on their backs to keep them close. As the young gorillas grow, they learn essential things from their moms and the rest of the troop such as what to eat and how to behave. This helps them grow up strong and prepares them to live on their own in the forest one day. What do they eat? It may surprise you to learn that gorillas are herbivores, so they eat plants and not meat. Their diet consists mainly of leaves, stems, shoots, and fruits. Scientists call them folivores because of how much they enjoy munching on the leaves of various trees and shrubs. One of their favorite foods is tender young leaves because soft leaves are easier to chew and digest. Gorillas are also known to eat some fruits that add a sweet and delicious treat to their diet. They use their strong jaws and sharp teeth to chew through the tough leaves and branches they find in their forest homes. Because they are herbivores, gorillas are naturally foragers rather than hunters. This means they search for their food rather than chase it. Gorillas spend a lot of their time carefully selecting the best plants to eat. They rely heavily on their senses of sight and smell and use these keen senses to find tasty leaves and fruits. Once they locate a yummy plant, they use their strong hands and fingers to pluck the leaves or fruits from the trees and bushes. As foragers, they depend highly on the vegetation in their natural habitats. Other interesting facts. Gorillas are part of the great ape family, and their scientific name is Gorilla Gorilla. They are as strong as bulldozers. In fact, they're one of the strongest animals on the planet. They use their strong arms and hands to gather food and build comfortable nests for resting. This strength also helps them swing from tree branches and move through their thick forest homes. And of course, it helps them protect the troop, maintain order, and defend their territory. When it comes to hygiene, gorillas are experts at grooming each other. Grooming is when an animal carefully cleans the fur of other group members. Gorillas use their fingers to pick out dirt, leaves, and parasites, tiny bugs that can bother them, from each other's fur. This grooming behavior serves several vital purposes. First, it helps gorillas build and strengthen their social bonds. Just like when we hug or help someone, grooming allows gorillas to show affection and care for each other. Second, grooming also helps gorillas stay healthy and clean. By removing dirt and parasites from their fur, they can avoid infections and keep their coats in good condition. Humans and gorillas have a lot in common. In fact, gorillas are our closest living relatives in the animal kingdom. We both belong to the same family, hominidae. Gorillas have hands with opposable thumbs so they can grasp objects and use tools just like us. They have similar emotions and express happiness, 
sadness, and even playfulness. Some scientists study gorillas to learn more about our own behaviors and evolution. So, when you look into the eyes of a gorilla, you might see a little bit of yourself reflected back. Why are gorillas important to the environment? Gorillas are incredibly important for the environment because they play a vital role in maintaining the health of the forest where they live. These big, gentle animals are seed dispersers, which means that they help spread seeds from the fruits they eat. When they munch on fruits and later move around the forest, they unintentionally drop seeds in different places. The seeds then grow into new trees and plants, helping keep the forest diverse and healthy. Without gorillas, some plants might not be able to grow, and this could affect other animals that rely on these plants for food and shelter. Sadly, gorillas are considered endangered, so there aren't as many left in the wild. One of the main reasons for this is habitat loss. The forests gorillas live in are being cut down for things like logging and farming. Additionally, gorillas sometimes face threats from poaching, which is when people hunt them for their body parts or capture them to sell. Conservation efforts are crucial to protecting these amazing animals and their forest homes. Wow, talk about some great gorilla facts. Let's review. Why are gorillas endangered? Where did you find that information? Choose the word the author would say best describes the gorilla. A. Defenseless B. Venomous C. Feeble D. Predator E. Gentle E. Gentle True or false, the author states that gorillas are as strong as bulldozers. True. Great job, primate prodigies! If you liked learning and reading along with us, please make sure you visit LearnBright.org for even more cool lesson plans. Hope you had fun learning with us. Visit us at LearnBright.org for thousands of free resources and turnkey solutions for teachers and homeschoolers.